So what prompted you to, to get the job? My dad put Ava in charge of my trust, and I refused to be under her thumb. So I renounced my inheritance and all that goes with being a Cassidine, including my father. Well, I respect your decision not to take the easy way out. You're being your own person. That's amazing, right? I'm proud of you. <laughs> Thanks, well, don't be too proud. I was this close to crawling back to my father. I was planning on telling him and Ava whatever they wanted to hear, doing whatever they wanted. What stopped you? A friend called me out. So what did he or she say to make you change your mind? She, yeah, she made me realize that I really do value my self-respect, which is a lot more compelling in theory than the reality of working an eight-hour shift here. There's part of me that wonders if I should just go back to my father and play nice, but it's just that every time that I show up here, I can't help but feel like, whose life is this? Okay, Carly caught me up on everything while I was gone, okay? <laughs> Your life now is at Kelly's because of the decisions you made, good or bad. You got to own up to that. And then when you do, then you can figure out where are you going to go from here. I know I made a mistake and I'm paying for it now. I got this humiliating minimum wage job. I turned down Ava's horrible deal, which would have made my life much easier, but I didn't want to be under Ava's control. I feel like I'm doing a pretty good job manning up here. What else can I do to prove it to you? You you broke my trust, so it's gonna take a little water in that bag. Really? That's all you have to say? You can't even give me a hint where to start? Stop looking for shortcuts. I always felt that your, your father gave you too many privileges. This isn't about shortcuts. This is about working hard. Gotta get used to that. You know what? There's always more than one option in life. You ever considered apologizing to Ava? <laughs> you didn't just suggest that. Well, you know, she's not my favorite person in the world, but she is the mother of my daughter. It's not about really Ava, it's about you. So you're saying that if I apologize to Ava, you'll trust me again? No, 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 no. This isn't transaction. If you apologize to Ava, it's because you're gonna do it sincerely because you messed up and you're gonna own up to that. I have owned up to it. Really? Yeah. Okay, listen, your behavior has hurt a lot of people, including my daughter. You're not a kid anymore, do you get it? You can't just excuse everything away. You know better than that, because if you don't, I can't help you.